Good morning, guys. Gabby and I are at horse camp. And, uh, yeah, so we're at horse camp and we're going to see what's going to go on. You guys feed in the morning? Yes. They feed the horses in the morning and, uh, Chino, you got to see Chino. He's Papa, already waiting for us. He's waiting for us. Hey, Chino. Hey, Chino. What are you waiting for? Are you waiting for us? Are you waiting for us? I got nothing for you. You waiting for your grain? Waiting for your grain, buddy? Hey? Hey? Looking at the camera? What are you waiting for? You're all dirty. Look at you. You're all dirty. Make sure Gabby cleans you good today, okay? All right. I'll see you later, buddy. See you later. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Sam and Sophie and I are on our way out. Um, so many things to update you on. Our world is crash crashing. We are behind the states, behind Europe. Like the coronavirus is not really taking down Canada yet the way it's taken um, other countries. We're kind of like the slower, the tail end of it, which is kind of always the way with Canada. Anyways, um, it is starting to take over. I anticipate everything closing soon. Our barn is closing after today. After today, there's no more anything. I am unsure of whether we'll be able to go there. I think, I mean, we're essential for the needs of their health. We take their food and um, exercise them. The, the plan is we're gonna have to bring them home. It's gonna have to happen, like, because I feel that after this, the, I, I know from other countries going through it, the next stage after closing the barn is going to be, everybody's going to be on isolation at home and I want my horses home. Like, even though uh, they are loved and cared for so well at their barn now, uh, I want, at home we'll have a bigger field, they can move around more and at home we can exercise them. We'll be able to ride them and go for trails and go for walks and we'll be able to spend this time with them so they're coming home our boys are coming home i'm like anxious about it i hardly slept last night did you know i hardly slept last night and the worst part about hardly sleeping is that once i'm awake all i hear is sam snoring it's the worst and then i can never get back to sleep it was bad anyways gabby's at camp we are going to the store because we need to get in fix our field no horse can come back to our house until our farm until our fields are Chino ready like he's a big horse but I'm excited and nervous and sick but you know what we're all going through this together and we will all get through it I know a lot of you guys don't have the option to bring your horses home and I am sick for you guys I understand how you feel just know that it's not forever and that God always has a plan there's a plan something good is gonna come out of this I just know it we just gotta wait and see you guys all right we are at our first store it is the water store well it says open in the thing it says open but it's closed it says drive through open only. We think we may have hit our first closed store. All right, we are here. I'm excited. Guys, I am slime. I'm excited, I'm nervous, I'm mostly excited. So I asked Fiona like, give us better idea of what we need for our horses. And so we're gonna do it right this time. We're gonna do it better. Mm -hmm. Even though Sam's gonna fight me on it. I don't know, I hate those. I want to put a gate. But to put a gate, you need wood, and we can't put wood in the ground yet. Because oh. we have two gates at home. It's a yellow one. What's this, though? Handle straightening. What? I don't have these ones. And what's wrong with those ones? They're longer. Um, I'm going to go. All right. So we have, we got two things of rope. We might need more. We got all the rest of the things that we need. Except for the tea post. We have to go outside and get those. Schleich. That's Schleich? This yeah. is, says Briar. Um, I love Schleich better. Schleich. I obviously have her. Do they have a border collie? A border collie. Does Schleich have a border collie? I think so. I just don't know. I see German Shepherds. And pigs. And pigs. And this Oh, puppy. and uh, Boston Terriers. Those are cute. And there's some more dogs and cats. No Border Collies, though. Oh, this isn't Schleich. Because we could buy a Border Collie Schleich and wrap it up for Gabby and give her yes. a puppy for Christmas. Yes. <laughs> I mean, for her birthday. Here's 
Uh, another Husky. dog. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's not Schleich. Who cares? It's not Schleich, but still, it's a Border Collie. Get it. Gabby's getting a puppy for her birthday. Yeah. <laughs> Look what we got. Look what we got, Gabby, for her birthday. Oh, border cool. Collie. <laughs> she don't tell her. Don't tell her, you guys. She won't see this. All right, you guys. Update time. All the barns in our area are closed. Up, uh, due to interpretation issues, not everybody is on the same page. Some barns are closed for everyone. Some are closed, are open for people who are caring for their horse like us. And I know that um, self-isolation is going to come. It's coming, you guys, and I want to have our horses home. I am not going to leave them for who knows how long away from us. I, to not see them every day, I know a lot of you guys are probably struggling with that, but to not see them every day would be heartbreaking. And we can bring them home, so we're going to bring them home. Sam's working on the field today. We're going to continue working on the field. I'm excited about it. Hopefully very soon we'll be working on it all weekend, and hopefully very soon we're going to have our horses home. Chino has never been here before. He's never known the love of having us with him all the time. Like, it's going to be crazy. And I'm excited and nervous, and it's just going to be crazy. Are you excited about having the horses home? Yeah. What's your... I get to buy Finny more. I know. And we're going to be doing a lot of trail rides. Even if it means just around our own property, we'll be playing with them in we'll be playing with them in our outdoor arena. We'll be doing so many amazing fun things. I'm always gonna make that. Lots of videos, right? Yep. But yeah, that is that's all happening. Now I need to get the chores done because we have to go pick up Gabby. Alright, so we need to get I forgot we need to get more feed pans. Do we need more water buckets? We have a lot of water buckets. Do you think we need more? I don't know. It's getting crazy. Finn's gonna get a new blue one. You want Finn to get a new blue one? We yeah. need to get we'll three more. Oh, we have already. Right. We only need to get two more. Chino has an orange one. So we need a red one and yellow. We need orange and, no, red and yellow. Okay, remind me. But Finn's getting a new blue one. No, oh, why? Why can't he have this blue one? I'll wash it and it'll be perfect. No, that one's bad. I don't want to buy, be wasteful in a coronavirus environment. You have to save money. But don't this be one's wasteful. Bad. This one's bad. All right, comment below. Do you think Finn should get a new blue bucket? Finn spoiled. So yes. You got your own money, sister. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous of Sam building the fence. Like, don't get me wrong, I love him and I love how much he supports us. Like, it's amazing. And I feel bad that his art, his legs are sore and he's still trying out there to do his best for us. I feel nervous though, like, I don't know. He wants to do it himself though. And I don't even know if he can hire anybody right now. Okay, so we are going to pick up Gabby and Sophie's having her last lesson. Somebody asked me today, did Sophie quit riding? No, she just chose not to go to camp. And all the lessons were canceled because of camp, if that makes sense. So there were not gonna be any lessons this week anyway, but today she's gonna have her last lesson. She's gonna have a lesson with Brandon. Gabby had camp Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then we're done at the barn. We're not allowed to have lessons anymore until the virus is over. So uh, we are bringing our horses home. But anyway, that's a whole other video. Let's go get Gabby and let Sophie have her lesson. Did you or did you not tell Sophie that she can't stay in the car today by herself because people are stealing kids to eat them? <laughs> did you tell her that? Yeah, I told her it was the apocalypse and there's no food around so people are stealing kids to eat. Please do not tell her that again because she was really upset. She was really concerned. I was joking with because her. You told her you were, you were joking. You okay, Sophie? You know now he was joking? Yeah. Aw, all the girls feeding Chino. That's a handsome man that's got a bunch of girls hanging over him while he eats. I can't your bear back on Polly. Ooh. I think I'm bruised. Can't I'm not, I'm a little Mommy, put too much salt in that. He I doesn't get salt, so it's good for him. We need to buy some salt licks for our farm. Uh, you're bruised? I don't know. In the next, All within. I 
before two weeks from today. All I felt was five. Because it's the end of the month. All right, are you guys worried? No. Well, really no. Yesterday, Gabby made Coco buff. Mm. She tried to get on a bear bag from the ground, and he was like, no thanks. You made her horse buck? She's teaching my pony back, and he got away from me today. She's so teaching your- open, And he ran out, and he ran me into a wall, and now I'm very sore. Gabby, you're a bad influence. <laughs> she dropped Sophia's saddle on the ground. <gasps> no, I didn't. Coco kicked it. Oh. <gasps> Giving everybody candy because the barn is closed. I, I won't. Do you want to take it and give it to your sister? Sure. Thank Everybody you. Don't need it. I'll get it. It's All right. Oh, Wait. Let's make sure. Here. Here. Giving everybody candy. Everybody's getting candy. All that work we did to make those candy bags, and now the barn's closed. So now we're giving everybody candy. I'm gonna save one for Brandon. Everybody's getting candy. Give everybody candy. She I pushed me off. off. She, I was laying on Nedra and she comes and puts oh, my feet on top of me and then just pushes me off. Oh. You are a troublemaker. And I broke her. put hair on me. <laughs> you got hair on you? Yeah. Oh, poor girl. <laughs> no. Okay, Gabby's taking her payment of candy. She's making everybody give them her hot, their hot lips. All right, Gabby, do you want to come with me to give Buns hot lips? And Molly's going to give the horses her candy. <laughs> Oh, Sophie, get tacked up. You ride it very soon. How was the triple bar oxer? Okay, first time we took off. The jump is this wall. We kind of took off here. Over that one. Did you almost die? Three, two, one. I need two close. <laughs> one more. Where I'm not so close to the jump and can actually get the video. Balance, three, two, one. Very nice. One, two, three. Good, coming to the oxer. Double. Three, two, one. Yes, leg. Good. Thank you. Change. Good. Come on, Chino, wake up. Okay, first pink oxer to the second pink oxer in this direction. Lots of leg, look up. Lots of go. Excellent. Okay, keep cantering. You're gonna go blue to teal and go left towards echo. Balance and slow him down. Good job! I totally didn't follow you with the camera at all. <laughs> Canter around to the triple bar. Shorten the rein a couple inches. Good. Sink the heel. Elevate the hand to lift the shoulder. Yes! Close your thigh. Three, two, one. Good, again, with a change. Nice. Ask him to step out after the oxer and use a little more of his corner. Looking up. Three, two, one. Much nicer. Good boy. Come over, oxer to oxer diagonal. He's like, I wanna be done, lady. Balance and rhythm, bring your shoulder back, close your leg. Three, two, one, yes, one, two. Lead change, step out and kick. Thank you, red to blue. Three, two, one, two, one. Better, let him walk. I'm glad you didn't. Did anybody just just Chloe fell? Chloe fell. Mm -hmm. Who's you riding? All right, we got Finny here. Let's pay attention to him. Finny. Finn and Chloe were lying down. Yeah, I can tell he was laying down. <laughs>